virtual from Harvest Hyde. I love to paint, I love to sell it. There's a special place in Safety Harbor that's changing perceptions about people with special needs. It's Harborside Studios and is located inside a charming, recently renovated turquoise cottage off Main Street. It's a place where minds with unlimited imaginations are unleashed to create beautiful, whimsical works of art. Harborside Studios is one of the three day programs of the Arc Tampa Bay. It's located in Safety Harbor in downtown. Uh, about 40 artists arrive every day to the studios ready to create art and ready to work for the day. They truly do see it as an experience um, that they're contributing to society, they're growing their skills. They have the opportunity to work every day and earn a living from the art that they're creating and the art that they sell in our galleries. All finished pieces are on display and for sale in the gallery. The artists receive 50% of their art sales. Paintings can range anywhere from about $35 to a couple hundred dollars. The artists paint with acrylics, watercolors, and oils. They also make ceramic masterpieces and jewelry. They restore old furniture, painting it with lively colors and capricious designs. It brings great joy to these artists when they sell a piece. Being a working professional reinforces their self-esteem. And most of them are pretty darn good. Take an artist named Michael, for instance. Although he is deaf and cannot speak, he has an uncanny ability to look at a picture and copy it with a near photographic accuracy. The artists are guided by an incredible staff of dedicated and compassionate instructors with artistic backgrounds. They work hard every day to help the students develop new skills. Although each artist has his or her own style, the artwork tends to have a primitive contemporary or tropical look that will go with nearly any setting, from the walls of an office to a living room or a playroom. Sometimes the artists collaborate on projects like the heart made from paper butterflies. This piece was um, made by a group of our students here at Harborside Studios. Each student picked out a different color. Um, they used a punch stamp, which was a butterfly, and then they attached it to this wooden board and they named it Happiness. In addition to the gallery, the artists sell their works at a variety of community events. Perhaps the most exciting is the annual summer art show held at the prestigious Sid Antel Galleries in Safety Harbor. For this show, the Picassos, the Ruin Walls, and other classics come down and that special art goes up. Once a month, the students come over and they look at what show I have. And I might be showing Picasso, or I might be showing a well-known artist of today's artist named Hassam. And then they go back and they work on their work and they do their own rendition of the, that artwork. It just gives them an inspiration. Then, once a year in, in August, we do this show, uh, Special Art by Special Hands, and the community is like knocking down our doors. We don't open our door until 5 o'clock, and as soon as we open the door, they run in and literally rip the art off the walls because it's, you know, well-priced and just beautiful, and they love owning work from these students. Um, I just can't tell you, every, it's a feel-good situation all around. The students are thrilled when their artwork sells. The community is thrilled to own these beautiful pieces of art, and we just love having it here at the gallery. Like I said, it's one of my favorite shows of the year. I got $700. Woo! Yay! Yay. Yay.